Welcome to Educational Byte installment number 57, presented by Acorn Internet Services. Why do so many innkeepers still have no mobile site whatsoever? We investigated approximately a thousand bed and breakfast websites, and our findings are as follows. We tested the attendees at the Mid-Atlantic Conference this past year in March, and 49% of the attendees had no mobile site presence. Then, in May of 2014, we took a sample of Pi Forum contributors, and 40% of those innkeepers had no mobile site presence. Then, in July of 2014, we went through all of our own clients, our hosting clients who were bed and breakfasts, and, similarly to Pi, 40% of those did not have a mobile site presence. And finally, we went through all of the select registry members as of July 2014, and 33% of the select registry members did not have a mobile site presence. Did you know that on average, 30% of your guests and your future guests are using a mobile device and not a computer to find you? So then, why do so many innkeepers have no mobile presence at all? Well, maybe they don't use a mobile device themselves and they simply do not understand the value of one for their guests. Maybe they think that a mobile site will only increase walk-in traffic. Well, that's not true. Mobile is not all about last-minute bookings. Maybe innkeepers just don't realize that your future guests are planning a vacation over dinner using their iPhones or their Galaxy Tabs or their Androids. Or maybe your future guests are looking for you while they're watching television using their tablets or their iPad minis. Or possibly your future guests are planning a getaway in bed on a lazy Saturday morning on their iPhones and their Androids. So let's take a look for yourself. Go ahead and log into your Google Analytics and set your date range. Set it from the beginning of the year till today. And on the left hand side click Audience, then click Mobile Overview. And look at your desktop sessions. How many folks do you have that are using a desktop? In this case, 58% were using a desktop. 25.71% were using a mobile device. And 15.69% were using a tablet. So if we add the 21 and the 15, you have over 40% of this particular innkeeper's guests were using a mobile type device even more so than the 30% average that we were finding as we searched other inns. You need to check your own Google Analytics and see what your numbers look like. The mobile timeline was, five years ago, Google told us, you need a mobile presence. Three years ago, Google told us they wanted it to be a separate mobile site. Two years ago, Google changed their mind and said that they wanted it to be a responsive web design, though they still supported both separate and dynamic designs. And then a year ago, an article was written that indicated that if your site is not doing a good job for mobile visitors, you better get that fixed. Sites with mobile experience issues won't rank as highly in Google's mobile or smartphone search results in the future. That was a year ago in June. Your mobile future is now. Don't get left behind. I encourage you, please contact us at info at acorn-is.com or call us at 877-226-7699 to learn more about how you can go mobile.